And we also had state baseball quarterfinals going on today. Classes 1A and 2A in Carroll and classes 3A and 4A in Iowa City. So let's start there in class 4A. Johnston going up against Icy Liberty in the opening game of the tournament. Sam Hesselman takes this one down the third baseline and that'll bring in Adam Keiko to score and it's 2-1 Dragons and the bats just stayed hot for Johnston. This time it's going to be Blake Lundholm who's going to get some pretty good contact here. Cracks this one into no man's land and Cole Kinman. He's going to get waved around. Lundholm will end up with a triple there and the Dragons roll past Icy Liberty 9 to 3. Well, on the other side of the bracket, Southeast Polk taking on Cedar Falls. This one was tough going for the Rams. Cedar Falls was up nine after four innings. Southeast Polk still showing signs of life. Ian McDaniel gets this one to drop fair and Landon Hamilton scores easily there on the triple. But Southeast Polk just not able to muster up enough offense to come back and their season comes to an end against Cedar Falls 11 to 1 the final. Well, let's take a look at some other scores from 4A and how about the little Cyclones of Ames are trying to pull off the upset and beat the number two seed City High. They were leading 4-2 as of last check. Dallin Catholic also moving on after defeating Dallas Center Grimes 4-3. And in Class 2, a magical run for Pella Christian came to an end. They played a great game and took the top seed Beckman Catholic to extra innings, but came up short 5-4, to four, and Woodward Granger also lost a close one to Cascade 7-6. to six. Stephanie?